Good morning, everybody. This is the uh, Hedge Investor McCrary Fund uh, uh, update for the month of January. Uh, January was a positive month for us, and we benefited both from our macro short positioning and our idiosyncratic bets. On the macro short positioning, um, we were positioned short, we remain short, we're very bearish on the development coming out of China. China is the biggest economic engine, has been the biggest economic engine for the last 10 years, pretty much, since the crisis. Um, we're very worried it's a serious supply shock. Uh, it will create inflation short term, uh, creating uh, quite a few headaches for central banks around the world. And at the same time, it will impact consumption and revenue across many companies and their growth expectations. Uh, we remain positioned short. Our best way to express this is via the banks exposed to Asia, uh, such as HSBC Standard & Charter, which we view as extremely overvalued, both in equity and credit. We also have uh, macro plays, such as South Africa or China CDS, uh, in relative value versus other uh, either indexes or uh, European sovereigns. Um, on the idiosyncratic side, uh, we had some good uh, uh, results on Oil Brazil, uh, Monte di Paschi, and Dish Telecom Network. Uh, we've been largely taking profit on some of those, uh, most of those actually. Um, we still view um, those positions as having quite a decent amount of upside, uh, but I think it may be a little bit slower going forward. Um, away from that, we actually suffered on a few uh, event names, T-Mobile, Sprint, Walgreens. Uh, we still think there is a uh, lot of upside on all those positions we have, such as T-Mobile Shorts, uh, Sprint Long, and Walgreens uh, Long Equity Short Credit. Um, we think there's going to be more development going forward, and we like the position. Overall, remain very cautious, very liquid. Uh, within the market is, you know, is in totally fantasy land uh, as far as the um, market dynamics are concerned. Uh, we see plenty of fragility, um, whether they are from China, whether they are on the market transmission systems. Uh, and so we remain positioned quite bearish, but very opportunistically, very cautious, because obviously the market is very strong and the market wants to rally. Um, no matter what, they want to buy the dip ahead of the dip, irrespective of dip. So we need to be very, very mindful there. Thank you very much.